In a matchup between the last two NBA champions in Abu Dhabi, the Celtics scraped out a W, and while Al Horford rested and the rest of the usual starters minus Porzingis sat out the second half, Peyton Pritchard was treating it like a playoff game. In three quarters, preseason P dropped a game-high 21 points, 6 assists, and 6 threes. Jordan Walsh had a great game on both sides of the basketball, recording 9 points, 4 rebounds, 4 assists, and 3 blocks. While being tied for a game-high plus 12, Walsh, along with J.D. Davison, seemed ready to step up into the rotation, as J.D. had some big minutes down the stretch to seal the Celtics' first win as reigning champions. Stay tuned. Right quick, 75% of you watching right now are not subscribed, so please subscribe if you haven't already. Splash thumbs up for the YouTube algorithm and follow at Hoops on Instagram and X for a follow back. Thank you for your support. You're tremendously appreciated. In game one of two of the Abu Dhabi games, the Celtics got down seven early, but an 8-0 run fueled by a D-White triple, a coast-to-coast -coast iso pull-up from Tatum, and a D-White duck-in lay-in forced a Mike Malone timeout. Jalen Brown would then get cooking in the late first frame by transitioning to the post and fading away on Kancar, pinning Vladko's layup attempt to the backboard with the swat on the other end, then cutting back door on Westbrook to get free for the one-handed hammer. Story of the first half was Peyton Pritchard, who in the opening 24 minutes alone had 14 points on 4 for 8 shooting from deep. From getting loose on the break and letting it fly in transition, to penetrating the lane, kicking before relocating and finding himself open, the quick twitch release from fast PP got sizzling. The second half kicked off with Pritchard getting his teammates involved, as after the loose balls poked out by Hauser, a look to the basket and quick swing to the corner to Tillman sets Xavier up for the triple, he'd zigzag through traffic to find Amiash Keita in the dunker spot, find Hauser off a of floppy action for the patented spot up triple in traffic, and push the pace to collapse the D and spot Jordan Walsh for the triple. It was then back to his own sniping, as Hauser would find Peyton as the trailer for this three-pointer, after of which Pritchard would get hyped, and to close out the third quarter and his night, while this wasn't quite a patented buzzer beater, he did use a moving jab to step back into this near buzzer beater from the logo with one second left. Peyton improved a lot in the offseason, as he looked smoother and more confident entering the fifth year of his career. Jordan Walsh started off his game by drawing the help of Saric to open up Luke Cornett for the lay-in. Here, Walsh breaks up the Westbrook outlet for the deflection, and then on the same play rejects Hunter Tyson. He's going to find Cato wide open on the interior after this flashy over-the-shoulder no-look, showing you the chemistry they built up with the main Celtics in the G League. First, it's JD driving and kicking at Jordan, then Walsh driving in midair overheading to Davison, giving JD enough room for the triple, collecting the baylor Shearman miss in transition, Walsh has enough momentum to rise up for the two-handed jam. Then off the Shearman kickout, it's Walsh 1-2 stepping into a 3. Walsh developed significantly throughout his rookie year in the G League. Amidst the showing where J.D. Davison had 7 points, was a plus 5, and posted 2 rebounds, 2 steals, and an assist, he'd have a nasty sequence where he'd fly back to swat this Trey Alexander layup attempt off the window, before taking it coast to coast where he'd flick up a left-handed lob to Dimitro Skabinstab for the throwdown, looking hungry to finally crack the rotation, or at least the roster consistently, after a few years in the G League, J.D. capped off his performance by draining the game-winning free throws. We'll see how the Celtics fare in Game 2 of the Abu Dhabi games on Sunday. This was your boy D-Flow, and I'll see you next video.